and welcome back to another Vlogmas video. Today we talk about something that is not really nice. We talk about the cons of Christmas. What are the things that what are the things that make you hate Christmas the most? I have a list of things that make me mad at Christmas time around Christmas time and that annoy annoy me around Christmas time. Thing that makes me mad, that makes me go crazy the most are is um, overpriced travel or overpriced uh, flights. This is crazy. Let's just not talk about the people that want to go on Christmas holiday that travel to have fun. I'm talking about the people that um, I'm talking about the people that live away from their families and they want to spend Christmas time, holiday time with their families, with their friends, with their grandparents, with their parents and so on. So for these people, paying a price that is so high to see their for these people that just want to spend time with their families, spending this much on a flight, on a train, or whatever it is, it is just crazy. It's something that shouldn't happen to me. I don't know where you live, maybe it's not like that, but here, a flight from Milan to Catania, which is a 55-55 minutes flight, costs uh, around uh, 300, maybe even something more euros. And of course, during the year, it doesn't cost that much. So it's crazy that the, the increment that it has around Christmas time. And it's so crazy because some people maybe cannot afford it. I don't know. This is something that really... It doesn't really make me mad, but mostly sad because we, we just... We, we lost this Christmas mood, this Christmas spirit. Another thing that makes me think that we lost the Christmas spirit is the fact that um, some places, some shops, make you pay to let your children write a Christmas letter to Santa. I don't know, I don't understand, I don't even understand that a child wants to write a letter to Santa in a shop because maybe it's better than writing it's not better, but it's most more appealing to write it there than at home in your house with your paper. Maybe there they have some great paper, something beautiful, something amazing. But I think, you know, that writing a letter with a child wishes, why do you have to make them pay for that? It's just, it's just crazy. I know you pay um, the paper, you pay the stamps, you pay everything to write a letter, but I mean, you have a shop that probably around Christmas time is full of people that want to buy things, okay? So why make people pay to write a letter with a child wishes, again? It doesn't, it doesn't really make sense to me. The more I repeat this sentence, the more it doesn't make sense to me. Other thing that we have a lot is traffic and we have traffic the whole year, but around Christmas time, it gets mad. It gets crazy and unbelievable. Once it took me 45 minutes or something more to drive three kilometers. It's insane, you can walk three kilometers and it wouldn't take you 45 minutes. It is so, so, so crazy. Um, and it was probably around the 5th or the set or the 6th of December. So we were not really into Christmas, into Christmas, uh, into December, uh, you know. And connected with traffic, we have like all the people that you can find in a shop and I know this is obviously a consequence of a Christmas shopping but sometimes the places, the malls, whatever are full with people and you cannot even see what they're doing and what what you're what you want to buy. It's so crazy. Sorry. 
but it just gets me makes me so so nervous already the saddest one is that we get caught by all of this stress we don't have time to relax we get even more stress during Christmas time because we have to think about what we want to eat what we have to buy who we have to buy for this is so so not Christmas Christmas is, is just about joy and spending time together and relax but we lost this and I know I'm boring saying this kind of things because it's obvious that we all lost our minds and we don't remember what Christmas is for but this is just getting worse year by year every year I see people going crazy for for the smallest things I see people um, forgetting thing forgetting things in places that you cannot even imagine mm -hmm they can be. Um, I see people having um, like, I don't want to say breakdowns, but sometimes they go really near that. Maybe because um, they, they don't know what to eat on Christmas Eve, which is again crazy. And I remember once we forgot some fish inside, um, inside the, the oven uh, we totally forgot it and that's that's a sign of it okay on a less serious note a thing two things that annoy me a lot during Christmas time are the musk and glitters the musk just goes everywhere you can clean how many times you want but it will still be there on the floor and you have to clean again the musk when you're making the christmas nativity scene i don't know this is a big deal to me this is a big problem to me i don't know how to overcome it actually it's just uh it just goes down <laughs> it just goes down if you if you try to stick it with glue i think that would be that would still go out um Another thing is glitter, as I said, and glitters are just uh, so beautiful because Christmas is all about uh, beautiful things, sparkling things, and glitters are great, but look at this, I have an example, look at this, this is a small decoration which beats my hand, that's pretty small, and that thing releases glitters every single day. It's like they regenerate. I don't know. This is something that you you have glitters in your kitchen, in your food, on your floor, uh, in the bathroom, on the bed, everywhere, everywhere around Christmas time. They just don't go away. You don't know where they come from because the decoration are still intact, and they still they are still losing glitter for all this time for all December until you put them away it's just <laughs> insane so this was my list this was my uh, list of things that drive me crazy that annoy me and that make me sad a little bit too of Christmas about Christmas um so Write down in the comments what your uh, what your cons uh, of Christmas are, and um, so we can chat about it again. And um, see you tomorrow. <laughs>